Alright, so I've just about finished the upper half of the exoskeleton. And I've added a few features. I think. Oh, jeez! Oh, there we go. Yep, here we go. Everything seems to be. Wow! Okay. Alright, let's give this thing a real test. Alrighty, time for the big test. Alright, so you might have noticed I'm kind of mixing universes here, Iron Man, Elysium. Well, an Iron Man suits the end goal someday, so, you know, might as well start early. Um, and that brings me to the uh, cool animation we had beforehand. That was made by my friend Steve. He runs the YouTube channel Rimstar Org and does all these cool science videos. So he did the CGI for that. And he actually did another video explaining how these cylinders on the exoskeleton actually work. So you guys should check that out at the end of this video. But, let's get to the test. So I got my little action camera set up. Start recording. All right, attempting to curl 171 and a half pounds with my homemade exoskeleton. Uh, system pressure is at 125 psi. The cylinders are actually ready for 250 psi. So if I can lift this, if I get a new compressor, I'll be able to lift twice this. Maybe. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. It's gonna be really awkward. <laughs> Slash bad for my back. Yeah. Hundred and seventy pounds. Like nothing. Legs feel it though. Uh, yeah. I don't know how I'm gonna set this down now. <laughs> It looks really smooth too. It was yeah. just like I 
lot of success. What's next? Alright, so I'd say that was a success. Um, it was really, it did not feel like I was lifting 170 pounds. I was helping a bit, but that's because my air compressor only does 125 psi. These cylinders are actually ready for 250 psi, which means if I upgrade my air compressor, I could potentially curl around 300 pounds, but I don't think my back or legs will take 300 pounds like that, so I'm going to have to build the lower half of this exos exoskeleton. So stay tuned, lots of updates coming, don't forget to subscribe, this is going to be an exciting project, and it's just going to get better from here. Thanks for watching.